this is. And this is how it is now. I don't recognize you anymore. Like, between us, there's some kind of a door. Conversations run silent. And the air hangs the whispers from people as I pass them by. Christian who sits on high. Don't curse by her. Don't smoke. Don't drink. Very sad. You think you know how I think. In fact, who are you people? Why do you care what I do? What does it matter to you who I pray to? Let me help you to understand just why I am so indebted to this beautiful holy man. If I can get you to understand the dynamic relationship with Christ, maybe you'll open up your arms too and let him hold you tight. God saw my life, my sins, my mistakes, and misjudgments that I commit. He already had a plan to save me and everyone through his son he sent. Let me say it again. Through his son he sent. Can you comprehend or understand that his son he sent to buy us back down from heaven this beautiful perfect being came down and his mission entailed being beaten whipped and adorned a thornful crown you all can't comprehend to Satan, you're just his lustful, sinful slave. To live and know Christ is more than church. It is living because you are saved. You cannot live this life thinking that you can travel it on your own. Some of you are so alone Lost in the dark? Yes, I said it. Amen. It is not important that you're the town drunk. It is not relevant how deep into drugs you sunk. The thoughts of suicide that are calling you to the more Jesus Christ came down a long time ago to let you know it doesn't matter anymore. God is giving you your struggle, each and every one of you, for you to trust and find him. He is applying pressure to create you. You're going to be his beautiful diamond. I'm not here to preach. That's not my mission. I'm just trying to enlighten your current state of vision. I used to drink, smoke, fight, curse, there's a list here, do witchcraft, and run to the graveyard, never caring that my road would end with my skin burnt, chopped. The hate inside me was so strong, it was like a smell that I would emit. Constantly thinking, planning. What's the next thing I'm going to commit? I had no idea where I went wrong or how I became so broken. I had no idea Satan was conducting the train. I walked up to him. I paid my own token. 
A loved one tried to speak of God to me, but I couldn't make the translation. The devil clouded my mind and my ears, trying, trying to seal my damnation. Seeing those devoted to God, I thought, oof, that's an awful chore. I was filled with anger and hate. It was down to my core. I was so consumed in witchcraft, I swam in its endless ocean, praying to my idols, giving sacrifices to my demons, and spells with complete devotion. Little did I know, my father, my Lord, was about to confront me to my face. But he came without anger. He came with love. He came with forgiveness. He came with grace. My beautiful child, he said, you have a terrible. Come to me. I offer you the cure, but I offer you protection. I saw this long journey. I said, <laughs> I can't complete that. I'm all the way at start. He looked at me again. My beautiful child. I'm right here where I've always been. And he pointed to my heart. There's a war for our souls. Mm -hmm. The devil's creating his collection. Yep. Mm -hmm. I'm here to testify to you. The Lord stepped in front of me, looked the devil dead in the face and said, she is not for your selection. Amen. Yes, I'm chosen. I'm saved. I've never declared perfection. All I need to do is try to be his mirrored reflection. For so long I was lost, but through Christ I've been found. So when he lets his trumpets boom and emits that sound, I have no worries, nervousness, or fear. You know why? Because I know my Lord is always near. The love he planted inside my heart, it is on fire. It is ablaze. Every day, I drop to my knees and say thank you, because he is worthy of all my praise. For those who try to mock my faith and be spiteful, you're not my problem. That's a fight between you and God. That's not something you should take like for. You can't hold a person's past against them. You can't hold my past against me. Yes, it's my sin, but I'm forgiven. I don't have to hide. I don't have to be stubborn and proud. Puff my chest out like I got pride. My fellow Christian, do not be afraid when life gets rough. Drop to your knees. Pray, be faithful. You are his chosen warriors. You can show them you are tough. To those who don't know him, open your heart and let the Lord who loves you in. It is a gift, it's free. You can pass to your kin. The Lord has a plan for you. It's not something you can outrun. He declared that you're his child. He cleared the way. He paid the debt when he said, it's done. Mm 